everybody. <laughs> I always punch at the beginning. Uh, it's because I'm using F10 as my uh, fraps key. And every time I do it, it kind of like locks the screen and I had to click. So now you know the mystery. Uh, we're going to start off by making another solenoid so that we can get the... Shit, I don't have any iron. There's some downstairs. But we're going to start off making a solenoid so that we can... Uh, actually mine a whole bunch without having to waste all of our iron and stone and sticks so yeah we'll just quickly do this and while we're at it no while we're at it we won't as far as I know the axe doesn't actually work that well especially when it comes to um let's just try this Especially when it comes to um, tree capitator. I don't think they're actually compatible, and that's really sad. So anyways, we're going to... thought that was my entrance. Uh, it's not. Okay. Anyways, we're going to come down here and finish up this stuff. I exposed it last time, and now we're going to mine it. And can you see how amazingly fast this is? Jesus Christ. Alright, um, we're just going to get as much coal as we can, and then take it upstairs. Well, we might just keep going, but I don't, know. I don't want this to be another mining episode. got 43 coal. Jesus Christ. Alright. That's good. Um, I don't remember why I dug these out. But I might as well dig them out a little more. <laughs> Instant profit. Okay, I like that. But we'll make it even because I'm kind of a weirdo. So. Look how much power we wasted though. Shit. We really need to invest in... Uh, some high voltage batteries so that this doesn't keep happening but for now we will 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 pop it on 10 pop it on but for now that's not going to do much um, it's actually probably a bad idea actually 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 so <laughs> uh, let's waste a coal might as well screw it Let's get rid of these. We don't need them anymore. I'm gonna keep the hatchet, but just shove it in there. I might bury the hatchet. Okay, we're gonna need that. And wooden transport pipes. Transport pipes. All of them, I think, are just made with one glass in the middle and then whatever block you want to make them with on either side. Wooden ones pull things out of chests. And the rest just kind of do their own thing. We need a wrench. And hang on one second. Okay. Oh, shit. Anyways, we need a wrench. And I think that's just made with tin or iron. One of the two. It's this one. The Omni wrench is bugged to hell with a lot of this stuff. So, I wouldn't even waste your time on it. It's one of those items that we kind of banned on our server because it just kind of kept crashing the server over and over. <laughs> so, we're gonna make a stone gear. I've shown you how to do this before. And it's iron, boom, boom. Yeah, there's our wrench. Now, this side is the side it's pulling from. So you want to make it hit this, 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 what is happening? Hit this side. But it doesn't want, that's, okay. Now I remember why I never had them close up together. Alright, uh, let's just knock this one out. Take the coal out of there and knock that out. Knock the wall out too, might as fucking well. 
liquid transposer. Stick it there now. No. Bad idea. Stick it there. It has to come out this side. Or come in this side or whatever. However you want to say it. So now we're going to need a uh, a stone stone waterproof pipe which is made the same way Ten, I'll just say nine whatever uh, I never get enough sticks out Jesus Christ okay. one two what am I doing <laughs> what am I Oh, I am so lost today. Okay. That's all I need. And I need one of these again. And I need to make waterproofing and waterproof the pipe. Okay. And now we just drop it in. And that'll work. I don't know. This might not work. It, it should work, but it, it might not. I haven't actually... It's very fiddly. Like, I've tried it and everything, and I've done it, but it's it's very, very fiddly. And it, it takes, um... It takes a while to even get any progress at all, because it has to get to... Let's see... Oh, hey, that's how you make a Pokeball that's reusable. You need a gas tier. Flux Pearl, what are you used for? Wireless Receiver. Wireless. Oh, how does that work? That's so cool. I used to have a factory in Old Tekkit where uh, I had a little remote control when Industrial Craft 2 was still in the game. I had a little remote control that could open up doors, and I had a computer terminal that I programmed to light up the um, lighthouse that was near it by just pressing the button on the computer. 2,000 megajoules. And we're at 1225 so as I said it takes quite a while but yeah I had this little computer it was in a swamp biome I always make my research facilities in swamp biomes for some reason but I'd make a separate facility for each mod that I was gonna test and it was amazing like this facility would mostly be the um, what mod is this anyways I think build craft and Mine factory, I think, is what it is. It's probably wrong. Other people know I don't. I didn't actually pay attention to what mods were what. Here are the mods. A lot of them are under mod. Okay. Uh, let's see. I'm just curious now. Uh, computer craft is in here still. Really? Wow. No, apparently not. Okay. That's what we used before to make all the cool stuff. Greg's lighting is pretty cool. I've done it once. Uh, if I ever have the stuff, I might just go over there and find it. And bring it back. Yeah, it looks like it's Mine Factory. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm going to actually make new buildings for this kind of stuff. Like this, it probably won't be here next episode. I'm probably just going to move it somewhere over there. I was going to make a giant castle. I mean, everybody was thinking it. I was just going to make a giant castle, and that was going to be all cool. But I kind of decided that... Uh, that's very slowly going. I kind of decided that that's not worth it at the moment, and I'm just going to make separate test facilities because it's more fun... And a lot more, um, me, I think. So, yeah, let's just kind of look around. Maybe lay a little bit of foundation for the next one. So this is going to be the... Ooh, what will this be? I might just leave this as the tinker table place. The power suit facility and just, like, open up bits of the floor. And have it just go straight up to the roof and you can just fly up into it. It'd be pretty cool. And I want to make an actual factory for all the factory blocks and everything. I need to make a storage house for all my storage thing. I'll just make a bunch of deep storage units probably. But, yeah, I mean, I've got some ideas. I got, I'm an idea man. We got this. 
I'm gonna break these leaves because they don't fit. Yeah. Yeah. We'll build one like right here. I'm gonna try to break it up too with different materials. I think this will be my storage shed. One, two, three, four, five. Five blocks on the inside, does that sound right? Six, seven. Two, three, four, five, six. No, that's not good. Seven. Okay. We'll do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. On the inside, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. And then. Right there. Okay. So that's going to be my. Maybe my storage unit. Probably not. Who knows? It'll be something. You'll find out sometime. You'll just come back to another episode and think, oh, cool, we're going to watch Marshall do stuff. I thought it was going. Maybe it wasn't. Oh, no, it's already in there. Okay, see, that just that shows that it worked. It, it's in there now. Okay, we'll shut that off because we really need to make more... Hmm. <laughs> Wrong button. We really need to make more ender pearls. It's a big waste of iron, but I'd rather not go kill a bunch of endermen for it. So if each one gives 250, it takes 1,000. So it's going to take around 4, I think. Yeah. It'll take four ender pearls to make one full container. I don't know why I had to say around. I knew the answer. I promise. We're not even going to turn that on until it's ready to go. There's not really much point to it. Uh, take that gold. There's copper in there. I could do with making some more engines while this is going. <laughs> I'm not going to have enough sticks. As always. Jeez. I really need to sort that out. Kind of like envisioning the future. Maybe I should have called this one future plans instead of the other one. <laughs> Seems kind of like a waste now. Yeah, I love these boots. Shock absorbing is amazing. <laughs> Maybe we'll make this like the Mistcraft building and just have like a bunch of libraries everywhere and it'll be really cool, like a little temple or something. Then I want to clear out some of this over here and build the storage unit. And over here we can have... Well, we're going to need a space lab. I mean, that's, <laughs> that's our main thing is we're going to need a space lab. It'll probably look a lot like this. Maybe it'll be that. Maybe that'll be my space lab, and yeah, I can just upgrade it over time and make it look really cool and just <sighs> straight up into the sun. <laughs> that was poor timing, sun. You could have gone elsewhere. Anyways, wrench, throw that in there. Um, we needed sticks. Not that stick, that stick can die. Okay. That is full enough that we can just start pumping it. And when it hits... Oh, I should have pumped it already. I think it's 4,000 or something to get it there. No, 1,600. But that still takes quite a while. Okay, we'll just go ahead and make our... Uh, all of our gears that we're going to need. Pistons. Four pistons? No, we only need to make two. Okay, pistons are done. Okay, now it's this, 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 and this. And we have more engines. Yes. We're just going to start this going again. 
waste all of our coal. We'll only put six in there because this one usually works faster as always. So that's it. Disabled and disabled. It works without it, but who knows? Who knows how it works? God damn it. That one's almost through. Okay, we'll shut that one off so it stops wasting coal. As soon as this hits 1600, we'll shut it off. Wow. Yeah, we'll shut it off. Just let it slowly drain itself while it fills it. Um, yeah, basically we're going to need a bunch of these to make these damn ion thrusters. Well, to make the force field emitters, we're going to need two. I was wrong. No, we need two of these. We're going to need four. So we could get to work on all the other stuff that we're going to need. Oh, hopefully we're going to have enough materials. But part of me thinks we won't. But, oh well. <laughs> Either way, it's a learning experience. Make our solenoids. And... We're going to need six invar ingots, two glowstone, and two wiring set aside. We're going to need two solenoids and two wiring per force field emitter. So we've got that. Let me just make my other two. Oh, I can't. I can only make one. I told you this is going to be resource killer. Wait. 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 I have enough already. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just saving it for the next one, I guess. Okay, so I have enough here for one force field emitter. And those you can use for things like active camouflage where you completely go invisible and that actually might be the only use I'm not entirely certain needed ion thruster for the swim boost an elite battery is an HV capacitor let's go ahead and look at that while we wait HV cap oh god that's it's not really as expensive as I think but it's expensive you just need to take a redstone block and melt it down in here. I think it only takes like three of them. And you just use another tesseract and you'll be okay. So we're going to use this tesseract on one of our pre-done things. And get our force field emitter. And we're already halfway there to one of them. <laughs> to one of them. Jesus Christ. This is going to take forever. This could probably take a couple episodes to finish, or I could just do one really long episode. Hey, hey, hey. Taking a drink again, because screw it. If this is going to be a long episode, I might need the drink to wet my throat. That's what she said. another one of those so we're almost ready we need to definitely well make sure that doesn't explode later but right now we need to definitely um, make some more obsidian or find some if we have it okay we've got it takes two per chunk we'll just throw all the lead in there that we have that probably won't be enough obsidian but I don't know. I honestly do not know anymore. Okay, good, it's got some coal. We'll let that do its thing. Um, we'll make some more Eyes of Ender. Because we've got one in here, so we're going to need three more for that one. Then we're going to need two more after that, so that's going to be another eight. So we're going to need 11 Eyes of Ender, which is going to be 41 iron but I don't have that much. So, I'll just use five. Ah, shit. Oh, come on. Turn you on. Uh, how about this? 
this. How's this going? I'm gonna need my diamonds. Is this working? Why isn't it? What's wrong with it? Uh, <coughs> Why are you not actually working? Oh, it has to be pulverized. Silly me. I'm wasting all this time. We're getting there. <laughs> I don't know where we're getting, but we're getting there. Where did it go? What? I, uh, uh, uh. Mm. Oh well. I guess it was cooking another one of those. So, so we should see this, and we can throw it in the, the uh, this thing, the induction smelter, and it should start, it should start smelting, yes, no, we need two, damn it, see, that's, that's how tech it works for me, I don't do something for like three or four days, maybe a week, and then suddenly I don't remember anything. This stuff will not cook, thankfully enough. There we go. And look how quick it is, too. Let's just turn the power off. It's got a lot of stuff to waste. We need diamond. Oh, we're not having enough diamonds either. But we've got enough gold that we can make our own diamonds. As uh, cheaty as that kind of is. I think. Because I don't think gold is very rare. And yet you can make diamond with it. Whatever. I could just choose not to use it, but I'm not above it. Nope. Okay, one, two, three, four, one. Pop that tesseract and a transposer. It's at 500. It's getting there. Uh. Hitting all the wrong buttons. Let's see, that should be done. Uh, yeah. Didn't think that through. Come on. Don't be so slow. This should be starting soonish. I mean, this should be well on its way. <coughs> Sorry, I had to keep clearing my throat. I, I just... Yeah, it's not very nice. Okay, now we can do another one. Alright, let's see. Four hardened glass. I imagine the only reason for hardened glass is really just to make it so that... Uh, things are less likely to explode in the event of an explosion and that you lose it all. That's what I'd like to say it is, but I could be very wrong. Okay, it's almost done. I left that on. <laughs> I can go off. Wait. Suddenly all the power is gone. Not enough. Balls. <laughs> People watching this are probably just getting more and more disappointed in me as I go. They're noticing things, they're just sitting there like, Marshall, why don't you see this? And all I can say is, look, I'm an idiot. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah. This episode is way too long feeling. It's not even that long. Get out of here. Go on, Joe. Okay. We need to chop down a couple trees from our little forest that we made. 
because I felt bad that I was chopping down all the trees. Isn't that how it works? Okay. We might have enough. We definitely have enough. Okay, we'll go in here, grab that last obsidian, throw it in the pulverizer, instead of this silver ore. Just throw that in there. It's a waste, but whatever. I'm, I'm not too worried about it. Um, this isn't making much power. Or it is, it's just not showing it. I should just turn that one on again, just so it'll be ready when the time comes. Oh, it is. The time has come. Okay, I'm everywhere. Uh, I think I might end it here and just finish making up these last couple of tesseracts, fill them up with ender pearls, and just call that good. So, yeah, yeah. What I'm trying to say is, I think that's the end of the episode, finally. <laughs> uh, it's a little bit longer. I guess it's just me failing over and over to do something right. We'll just make this last tesseract. Oh, we can't. Don't have diamonds. All right, so I'll go look for diamonds, and I'll come back, make the last couple frames, throw them in there, let it do its course, and once I have all of those done so that I can make these, I'll come back and show you how to make the high-volt battery. All right, until next time, see ya.